vitamin D in diabetic kidney disease and why you must take it. I've spoken about vitamin D in other videos and how important it is. More research now about just how much you must take it if you have diabetic kidney disease, whether type one or type two. So this piece of research from July issue, Journal of Renal Nutrition, 2023. So they looked at six studies total where they use vitamin D. Now they use the synthetic prescription D2. So you have vitamin D2 and vitamin D3. D3 is the natural over the counter form. D2 is a prescription synthetic. So they gave 50,000 for eight weeks. At the end of eight weeks, they found they had less protein in their urine. They found this in type one and type two, but especially in type two diabetic kidney disease, it was very prevalent, type two diabetes. So you can either get, ask your doctor for the prescription or you can use a natural D3. A D3, if you're gonna use a natural, you wanna use anywhere from 2,000 to 5,000 a day. I use upwards of 100 micrograms, 125 micrograms. Okay, they're using micrograms now but we're still using IUs. So either or the vitamin D or the D3, they show benefit. It also mentions here it helps reduce inflammation. So you really want to take it. Now, the blood test goes from 30 to 100. If you're 30, you're sufficient, but you're not going to get all the benefits that you will of vitamin D. You're just not going to get them all as if your level was more around the 50. I generally say 40 to 60. I like 50 to 60 better. I even think 50 to 70 is fine, but at least strive for 50 and ask to look at it. Okay. You want to get a copy. You want to see that vitamin D level with your own eyes because you'll tell your doctor or ask them, how's my vitamin D? And if they tested it, they may see it at 30, 31, 32, 36, 38, and be, oh, it's good. It's fine. What does fine mean? What does good mean? Okay, you want to make sure you get it to 50. If you're not at 50 and you're taking vitamin D, whether it's D2 or D3, then you got to take a little more. And ideally, if you do take D3, you can get it with vitamin K2. It's better for you, but still D3 by itself is fine. Okay, they don't have D2 with K2. Other videos we have on on vitamin D and how good for you, what it can do for you. Subscribe to our channel. We have hundreds of videos how to help yourself into your best kidney health.